Hello beautiful souls, welcome to my channel. It could have been a dark and dreary day, it could have been a funeral procession, heads hung in mourning numbers, a young woman in infinite slumber, buried in rich red velvet and dark mahogany, her friends and family in agony, they ask why did she want to leave, to go and make us grieve? The thick grey headstone might have rolled, our daughter forever we lay her to bed. Then they did walk away, weeping and she did just be sleeping. That was the way it could have been. After weeks and months, maybe ten years would go by, and someone would query who was that girl so angry it was eerie. That she would want to die even before she gave life a try. Or ask, think of her mother, what must she feel? Does she still think if this is actually real? Or does she wish her baby will still come home, even though now her soul might roam in the wide open world she need out so severely, despite the people she hurt so badly. That was almost the way things turned out. That seemed the only way to go about the confusion inside her heart and soul. That pain added to all other hurts, the whole suffering that came with the package. All that battled emotion turned to rage. She found a self-destructive outlet, her way of screaming would be quiet enough for no one to hear her pain, and all that fear of dying in that grotesque way wanting to go needing to stay that is not the way things are now she has learned and she knows how to feel pain and cry letting it all go and flop away with the breeze so she is happier her mother does not ask why her friends don't wear black marching by her grave her family does not weep at the memories they so painstakingly keep. Now all together they can sit in the sunshine, making new memories and laughing away the time. She loves what life gives her, even if it invokes a tear to form she is glad to even be here. I see this courage gather in her thoughts of inferiority. I see these thoughts of abandonment that make her cling to anything. I see this devotion to her beliefs that makes her fear death. And I hate that the person I always see is me. Now I share my breath with you and hold dear to the memories we have shared and will continue sharing in the times ahead. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe.